Hi everyone, my name is Miss Abby and I'm the Children's Services Manager at the Main Library. I'm here virtually with my friend Miss Ruth. Um, we are practicing social distancing today and today we are going to break some eggs. Or actually we're going to try to not break eggs because we are doing the egg drop challenge. So today we are going to design a landing craft that protects your egg passenger when it's dropped from way up high. So we are going to use the engineering design cycle and we're going to design our landing gear. We're going to test it to see if it works. We're going to change the design to make it better and then you can retest to get new results. But the most fun thing is grown-ups and you can break some eggs. That's the fun part. So we've got some really great books here that you can enjoy as you're designing your egg carrier. So our first book is The Boy Who Invented the Popsicle. So this is a really great new book about a kid named Frank who invented popsicles. So he was an engineer and he was, um, and he did a lot of testing and retesting and he would tinker and analyze and finally he came up with the tasty treat that we all know and love today. And then the next book is Rosie Revere Engineer and Rosie Revere is kind of shy and she makes all these wonderful inventions and she also uses the engineering process. So that's what we are going to do today is we are going to design our egg carrier. So all you need to do is find just stuff that you have around the house. We're not doing any kind of rules with this egg drop challenge. So these are some things that I had lying around the library. I had some bubble wrap, I had some cotton balls, some popsicle sticks, toilet paper and paper towel tubes, some styrofoam, some cardboard boxes, and of course, lots and lots of tape. So we just put it all together and we put our egg inside and we came up with our design. So this has a lot of cardboard, a lot of styrofoam, some cotton balls, a plastic cup with the egg securely taped inside and we are gonna see how it works. So I made my material list, which I used a sock and some foam and some hot glue. And so when I put mine together, I cut the toe off of my sock to wrap my egg in, like so. And then I cut the foam into triangles to make my little lander portions. It reminds me of the moon lander because I remembered that triangles are, are strong structures, which you can learn more about in some of the engineering books that we have here at the library. And then I put my egg in the middle and use the rest of the sock to wrap around it. And we'll see how well that protects my egg when we drop it. I did 